over here is the Station Inn at Ribblehead. You can stay there free of charge in your camper van as long as you use the pub to eat or drink. We're hoping to come back in two days because we have a campsite booked for two nights and then hopefully we're going to come over here and park up in there for one night anyway, maybe two, depending on what the weather's like. Right, that was a quick recce and now we're off to find our campsite, which is about 12 miles away. Good morning, it's Monday morning, we are in the Yorkshire Dales. It didn't rain much last night actually, we expected it to. It's a bit brighter today, so hopefully we're going to do one of the Yorkshire three peaks today. It's free to do, we're not going to rush, we're not going to do them all in one day. We're going to do them in three days, trying to avoid the rain hopefully. This is Dales Bridge Campsite. £26 per night with electricity and hard standing which makes it easier for the vans and everything really. There's Jack looking as happy as ever. Well it's definitely brightened up isn't it? Yeah. We might be lucky. Let's go! Excuse me sheep, is this the right way to Penagent? Look at the sign, oh yeah, okay. Penagent, the Pennine Way. So it's up there somewhere in the mist. Or the low cloud, I should say. <laughs> well, yeah, it's not too bad. Straight away. Yeah, but if you step, you'd be moaning. Small cottage. This is um, Jack's new school. Probably about 60 kids, something like that. Maybe less, it's a tiny little place. Horton Old School. Getting closer. Pen again is up in the clouds. somewhat. Still cloudy but it's not as bad as it was. I think we're about 460 now and I think Jack says that was 694. So another 230 meters to go and a bit of a scramble I believe that's why we're coming this way because it's wet. It's easier to go anti-clockwise.
cloud. But we're underneath it all now. Luckily, so far, we haven't been caught in the rain at all. Do you believe that? Now this is whole pot, it's a collapsed cavern, it's 91 metres long, 18 metres wide and 18 metres deep. In dry weather, the beck actually goes back underground, but as you can see, in the wet weather, it flows here. All sheep crossing the road. That's two sheep crossing the roads we've seen today. Oh, poor dog. Stay in. What's this one called, Jack? Ingleborough. That's it, the last one. Oh, these cattle are nice, look at these. Beautiful colours. Very. Fishes. Fishes. Hello. 